He radioed from the ring, said he'd be here tomorrow. Hey, you! Leave him alone! I killed him myself with my slingshot. Let him learn to stand up for himself. How else can he hope to survive in the match? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now? Doctor said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. 
There's only us. Colonel. Hello, Alex. There you are, you stubborn fool. How many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop. There's only Metro, nothing else. And the Order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me. So get ready to go. Then we'll discuss your transfer to Polis. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom? Please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Still, lucky those Spartans are damn good. They brought Artyom here just in time. They sure are. I cannot remember the last time I saw a bunch of healthy and fit people down here. Nah, me neither. It's a shame they spend so much time on the surface. Eh, well, sadly, it's their job. Well, job or no job, if they keep doing that. Artyom, just try to take better care of yourself, huh? Even if you find someone else out there, they probably have their own troubles. So what would contacting them even accomplish? Besides, I remember we used to receive signals from the outside pretty frequently soon after the bombs fell. But not for a long time now. Doesn't that tell you anything? Ah well, it's your life. Artyom, I understand how you feel, but you're not always going to save the Metro single-handedly. Why keep looking for a solution alone? Job or no job, I can do it. You must come back to Polis. Well, not everyone can stand being cool. I left the order, and now nobody gets to decide for me. As for Artyom... Oh, I can't believe my eyes! Artyom! You're all right. You gave us a scare, scare brother! Artyom! How are you, friend? I see Pardon you're all me, right. Pardon me, gentlemen, give this way! This calls for a celebration. Artyom! A few more scars and you will be completely irresistible to any woman! Speaking of which, Hello, how you are the you nurses in the hospital, guys, huh? You just stop crowding him. <sighs> Brother. Previat, uh, uh, Artyom. All right, you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. it's official. Yeah. I knew it. You guys are like so I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. I can hear is that Geiger counter ticking. <sighs> ah, yes, and there's also those damn things calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? 
silent, Artyom? Because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Move it. We don't need any extra radiation, darling. Oh, father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hanta off-limit zone. Have you been to all these ruins? <sighs> See all the destruction. And Moscow had the best anti-air defenses in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world looks. There's just no way anything can live up here with the monsters. Look, maybe you should come back to the Order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go in turns here. It's not stable enough. Careful. At least it held. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Whoa. Hear that? It's a pack, just what we need. A draw. We're lucky the mutants hate each other as much as they hate us. I really don't get why this zone is off limits to stalkers. The radiation and beasts are nothing special. That is all of them. I'm glad they didn't notice us. That was a large pack. Oh, is this why the zone is off limits? I mean, if all the packs here are like that. to cross the railroad. It would save us a detour. Damn, too high. Hey, Hartyom, help me get out there. Shit! 
Come up now. I got you. You should have checked first, assholes! Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one Look, for what's that. what's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, we'll tell the whole Metro about this. The heck and the boy out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back.
damn workmen broke through. These workers are done for. Keep your weapon trained when we open it. If anything comes through, shoot. What a noise! Attention! The turntable is switching off! Shut up. Now listen, if you come out of here, we won't accept this shit again, okay? Chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. Fit that prime jacket, huh? Yeah.
might be distracting him. Look, there's some garbage around. Throw some. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. Well done. Sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go! Who are you? I'm Brian Valerie the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar, then go to the. Easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Uh, hey guys, be careful. Hey. Hey. Artyom, I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Oh yeah! 
Tank reporting. Naturally, they're pretending to be civilians. <laughs> you get these. Huh? Is there someone over there? Oh, yeah! Attention! The command center came under enemy attack. The attackers are assumed to still be on the base territory. Artyom, I'm changing position. This sucks. All unauthorized persons are to be fired upon the <laughs> Civilian personnel movement is prohibited until further notice. Hey, what's that shadow? The shadow system is coming back online. Artyom, <laughs> oh, covering you! from behind the gate. There's nobody out there, that's for sure. If the outside gates so it could only be watchmen. What if it's the attackers? Well, then those watchmen just have it. A knife, here. Hey! seconds to surrender. Think about it. You might stay alive after all. <laughs> Throwing cans? You truly are grasping for straws. Oh, he's here. He's here, all right. Huh. Fuck! Where is he? Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there Come and on, switch Jim. the turntable mechanism on. And please, be careful. We could easily have the whole base.
Turn the turntable on. together. survive alone. There, in the ravine, there are people from other cities, dead, all 
Remember, women, up. children! I'll tell you all later. Everything. Gramps, what's going on out there? Down this road. The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste, though. They called the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to it's not my this call, and you're misunderstanding. Not. Well, I'll fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. Alright, Spartans, throw these overboard and full steam ahead! Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch the mare. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone! The whole fucking world! And not even batting an eye! Yo! 
motherfucker! Now you've done it! You, your writing, your daughter, you all be Easy! We are falling down! 